Hey, what's up you guys? This is Zach with PC Bros. And today I'm gonna show you how to fix the CSGO 2 issue with MSI Afterburner. So this was a problem with CSGO 1 as well. They don't allow for any third party software to avoid cheating and anything like that because it is a competitive game. But if you still wanna benchmark games, there is a way to get around it. So I'm gonna show you two things that you're gonna to need to do to make it work. So step one, we're going to open Steam, and you should already have Counter-Strike 2 downloaded. You're going to right-click over Counter-Strike 2 and go to Properties. So this will open a new window here. You're going to stay on the general, the top tab. Scroll down a little bit, little bit until you see Launch Options. This is where we're going to type in our command. I'm going to leave the command in the description below so you don't have to type it all out. You can just copy and paste. But the command is going to look something like this. It's going to be dash allow underscore third underscore party and then underscore software. Now, again, I'll just leave this in the description so you can just copy and paste it right in. Then you can exit out of this. It will save. And then you can minimize Steam. That is part one done. For step two, you're gonna to wanna to open MSI Afterburner and then open the application that comes with it, Reba Tuner, so you should have this uh, application open. And on the bottom left, you'll see an add button in green. Click that and this is going, we're going to try to find the folder for CSGO, the application. So there's a couple different uh, places to find it. It might be a little bit different for you. We're gonna go down Click here, go to Steam, scroll down a little bit until you find Steam Apps, Common, Counter-Strike Global Offensive. Now this is where it gets a little bit different for everybody. For me, I'm going to be clicking Game, Bin, Windows 64, and then go to CS2. So this will show up here, and now we can minimize this, minimize MSI Afterburner and run the application and see if it worked. So as you can see in the top left, it looks like it did work and you can change all the settings just like you can regularly. Now it should work just fine from here on out. Just make sure you keep MSI Afterburner and Reva Tuner minimized in the background. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please like and share if this was helpful. Leave a comment down below on what tutorial PC Bros should do next.